This school seems a bit loosey-goosey on their rules. Guns, short shorts, zombies. Yeah, it's the worst. Now we're standing at the end of the world, my friend, and there's nothing we can do about it now. Yeah, we're standing at the end of the world, my friend. We're gonna watch it all burn down. Yeah, we're gonna watch it all burn down. Paulina! Paulina, hurry! You're gonna be late for school! You gotta go! You gotta be there by 7 o'clock! What? Wait a second. Uh, I don't think you can bring a rifle and a submachine gun. No. Um, I don't think knuckles are approved either. Or spear. No, it's a gun-free zone, weapon-free zone. Put everything... Stop. Stop. We have school. Let's go. Hustle it up. You're gonna be late. <laughs> so welcome back to 7 Days to Die. We're going to school. Gonna be there by 7 a.m. So let's hop on the bike and let's roll out. Yeah, we're gonna be late. Paulina's gonna get detention. I think we'll make it. I have a feeling Paulina Punchwood here probably had a lot of detention in school. I have a feeling that uh, her parents were called to school quite often. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Punchwood, it's about your daughter. Could you come in? We have to discuss some things. <laughs> Oh, yeah, well, she's a little rebellious, right? She's got a rebellious streak in her, so that would make sense. She's pig-headed, and she doesn't like taking orders from anybody. She's the boss, according to her. So, yeah, um, wait a minute, wait, wait for it. Okay, now we can go in. She has to show up late. Fashionably late, that's how she rolls. Anyway, let's check this out. We have a Favalis, Favalis Academy. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly how you say that, but that works for me. Let's uh, let's put this on, Paulina. There you go. So nobody will recognize you anyway. So we can get away with murder, which we're probably going to do. Since there's a bunch of zombies in here, most likely, and they're going to need to be murdered. And we're the people to do it. Uh, let's bring a frag. Yeah, I think a frag will serve us well in this school because there's probably a lot of zombies in here. And we might want to blow up a whole bunch all at once. Oh, oh they locked the doors. Right, it's to keep the drug dealers and the uh, and the bad people out that want to do harm. All right, well, you know what? We're coming in. We're late. Let us in. <laughs> Smash it. Actually, hold on a sec. We we got some dynamite here. This is, what we, this is how we do it. Oh, light it. No, no, you got to light it first, Paulina. Oh, no. Pick it up. Light it. And now... Toss it, and here we come. Open up. We're late. Gonna get the home room. Wait, do they still do home room? I don't even know. Oh, sorry. All right, let's uh, let's check the lockers here. So I'm thinking. Here's the thing about schools. Schools have a lot of books, right? So I'm thinking we're gonna find lots of books here. And uh, oh, this has a football guy. <laughs> Someone's helmet. <laughs> I hope the game's not today. I hope there's no game today, because uh, we are about to scrap that thing. Oh, that's a nice tank top. Is that better? Yeah, I'm getting distracted by silly clothing and stuff, but we really want to focus on books. I want to find that... Um, I'm just going to scrap it. I really want to find the... Uh, I want to find the, the crucible recipe, right? So that would be fantastic. Do we need a helmet? Not really. We have... We have helmets. BDU bottoms are pretty nice. Steel leg armor. Okay. Yeah, I'm already getting distracted. I want to focus on um, on books. Let's go. Uh, let's go left around the world today. I feel like I feel like going left. Oh dang it! All the doors are locked. Maybe there's somebody in there. Hello? Open the door. We gotta get in the home room. We need to be here for roll call. I don't want to miss roll call. <laughs> but wait a second. I think the nurse is coming out. Um, Bolin is fine. Oh, jeez. Sorry, that was meant for the door. Oh, wow. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> oh, another one. I think they got to call Paulina's mom and dad today. She's being a bad girl. <laughs> Just killed two nurses. Hey, what up? This is what I'm talking about. I told you. Books. Uh, shotgun Messiah. We don't even have the shotgun today. Shotgun slug. Slugs are like huge bullets that travel much farther than buckshot. You can craft shotgun slugs. Okay, that's pretty cool. But what we really want is a dang crucible been after it for so long i'm not leaving this school until we get one so somebody better come forward and uh and hand it on over all right let's uh you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna make a whoa i thought i saw something running past 
in the street. It was just a, a flicker. Just a flicker. Let's make a crate. Oop, that's not how you do that. Storage chest is what it's called. And we're going to put it down right here. I'm going to chuck a bunch of stuff in here that we don't need. We'll put it right here by the door. And we'll grab this stuff on the way out or later or whatever. We don't need to carry it all around. I just want the things we need to get through this school day. Which is like, you know, guns and ammo and grenades. Yeah, gun-free zone. Right. Uh-huh. Um, which is kind of crazy because if you have a gun-free zone, guess who's going to bring the guns? The outlaws, of course. And if you outlaw guns, only outlaws will have guns. At least that's what my dad's bumper sticker said. All right, let's not get political here. There's a sweatshirt here. We don't need that. Oh, this, all these doors are locked. All right, yeah, uh, hang on. Coming in. We'll help you out here. A lot of nurses in this school. Uh, hmm. Can't tell if that's a student. Oh, it's Miss, uh, it's Mrs. Mrs. Baroni. <laughs> I don't even know where that name come from. Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Dead. I couldn't think of anything. Baroni. It's actually like a real name. I think one of my kids had a teacher named Baroni. All right, let's just take care of the nurses, and then um, and then we can go in here. I want, I want to get him with a hammer again. That was pretty fun. Wow. That is fun. It's got some good reach, too, and a lot of damage, but I do like punching. Punching. Yeah. This is what Paulina has wanted to do her whole life in school, is just wreck all those teachers that made her read books. Uh, paper. No. Come on, Crucible. I need a dang Crucible. There's a backpack right here. That's pretty cool. Ski goggles. <laughs> Looks like somebody was going to go skiing. I wonder if they haven't made it. So there's a whole lot of desks here. You can't go through these things, can you? No. All right. So that's two bookshelves already. That's pretty good. So we're not doing too badly so far. My theory was correct that we will find bookshelves at the, um, in the school. And look at all the backpacks everywhere, too. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Somebody took all the books from this bookshelf, unfortunately. Can we check? Oh, some of the desks you can check, too. Padded, a p padded hood. Uh, it doesn't really sell for very much, so I'm going to scrap it. And ski goggles give you plus one agility. Ooh, that's kind of neat. I will not scrap those. I'm going to hang on to those. I'll go put them in our chest over here by the front door, and then we shall continue our um, raid here. School raid! You know what I forgot to do? Spend some skill points. We have two available, and I really do want to bump up Lucky Looter, but it's going to be expensive. We need Perception of level 5. So let's, let's bump up Perception one more. That'll give us a little extra headshot damage and 20% chance to dismember with rifles, explosives, and spears, which we use quite a bit and we're gonna have to go up one more too man I, I really hate spending all these points but lucky looter is super important and by the way i did actually increase the uh the amount of xp that i'm getting per kills i don't know if you saw that but it is bumped up about 25 percent so now we have a level five perception and we can buy lucky looter um after we level up which is going to be very very soon Maybe we should have leveled up first and got Lucky Looter up first before coming to school today. But we didn't want to miss school uh, and be reprimanded. Oh my gosh. Steel leg armor. Those I can actually sell, right? 51? Oh, that's not bad. What's with all the armor here in the school? <laughs> Were the kids preparing for something? I don't know. Maybe they knew the apocalypse was coming. Did we... Uh, we did not check this room, did we? No. Some of these desks you can't actually loot. Nothing in them. Might as well check the trash, too. You never know what kids throw out these days. All right, more leather. I'll just carry that around for the moment. Lots of lockers. Uh, baseball cap, of course. That might look cute on Napoleon here. And a bloody shirt. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. We don't ask questions here in school. Okay. Let's break into this one here. Man, this is sledgehammer it does a number. Oh, what is this? It's bathroom? Looks like a bathroom. All right. Anybody in here? Okay. Let's grab all the lemonade. Check under the sinks. Oh, what the heck is this? Somebody hid Grandpa's awesome sauce recipe under the sink in the bathroom. 
Reading this recipe would teach you how to craft this item. Grandpa's awesome sauce. I don't know what the awesome sauce is, but we will look into that. If you know what it is, put it down in the comments. I'm curious. Oh, you know, we should probably grab lead and stuff now that we can make the slugs. Um, well, we have the recipe for slugs. We still haven't gotten to that point yet where we can make ammunition, but that's something we're going to be doing down the road. Grain alcohol in the school bathroom. Fantastic. Just what we wanted to... What? I knew I saw something running around out there. It's a bunny rabbit. Oh, you. These, these rabbits are in cahoots with the wolves and stuff, so we should probably take him out before he goes to tell somebody. And I missed. Oh, Paulina. Come on. Come on, you're better than that. Wait for it. Got him. <laughs> Sneak attack damage on a bunny rabbit. All right, let's go chop him up. I uh, got my knife right here. Ooh, man. Distractions, distractions. I also made another change. I sped up the days, or at least shortened the 24-hour cycle, which means we're going to have shorter days and um, and we'll have nighttime fun. That was the whole point of that, so that we can have some actual nighttime play because we, we don't get a lot of nighttime play. So I thought that would be interesting. Uh, just check the knife in there for now. I'm going to bring all that stuff back eventually. Whoa, pick up your axe. Okay, so there's a fire. All right. Now, where were we before we interrupted by Spy Bunny? Over here, right? Ooh, vending machine. Ooh, yucca juice smoothie. Delicious. 156 coins. Wow. That's kind of outrageous. I'm not going to worry about that. Let's keep moving. Room's already open. Nobody in here. Check the trash. Oh, we got a uh, we got a note. Someone's passing notes around. A strange note I found while looting a school. It's from Crazy Jake Clan. Kill some nurse zombies. Oh, dang it. I wish we had that a few minutes ago. And look. Bookcase. Bookcase. I might save that until we get Lucky Looter. Uh, the next level of Lucky Looter. We're almost there. If we kill enough people in this school... Then uh, that sounds horrible. Then we can um, maybe we can get the next level of Lucky Looter. That's a pretty nice shirt. I just wish it was a nicer color. It's good for cold resist. Yeah. All right. Pauline is gonna hang on to that. That'll look nice. There's another backpack. I'm gonna keep my eyes down. Find these backpacks on the ground. Another bloody, dirty skirt. Um, how's your water doing there, Paulina? Yeah, she's fine. All right, yeah, I'm going to leave that bookcase. Just Let's just remember that it's here. Do I have a way to mark it so I don't forget? You guys will let me know, right? Uh, I'm just going to put a little block right in front right here so I remember. Fantastic. All right, let me go dump some more garbage here. This is a very large POI, and it's going to take some time to loot the whole thing, and we're going to have lots and lots of loot carry around and dump out, etc. It's a big steel locked doors. It's not a fire hazard. I don't think I, don't, I think that's against the rules. Another bookcase, guys. Fantastic. And bullets <laughs> in the teacher's desk. <laughs> we got running shoes, no extra abilities on these running shoes, which is sad. Let's put um let's put another little thingy here. Again, as a reminder, there's two bookshelves waiting for us, but we just got to keep leveling up. Got to keep leveling up. Are we done with the first floor? Oh, no. Oh, no. Heck no. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are these uh, former faculty members? Hmm. It's an old, old school, maybe. Right. What do we got here? Oh, hi. More nurses. Wow. This place is loaded with nurses. Maybe these were some sickly kids. Why? All right, hold on. Have patience, ma'am. Ladies. Someone on that side, too. Who is that? Oh, it's Mrs. Baroni. Whoa! <laughs> Looks like they got through. <laughs> I didn't even notice. <sighs> All right, let's let's uh, let's use our new spare skills because we have that awesome new perception. And uh, we don't use the spare enough. It's kind of fun. Right? There we go. And it's fun to punch, too. I love that extra XP. Yeah, I figure we might as well get the ex extra experience boost. It's only another 25%, but it, it should help. Gaining experience, obviously. And uh, <laughs> getting more of the skills and stuff that we want. 
because I feel like the leveling is just so slow. I hear more footsteps around here. I just don't know where they're coming from. I don't want to get snuck up on. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Someone's getting feisty here. You want to call the principal? Okay, go ahead. Call the principal. Go on. I dare you. I dare you. I double dare you. I triple dare you. Someone's busted in from the backyard. From the from the playground and recess area. Yeah, hold on. Hold on. This must be one of those local drug dealers trying to get in to sell drugs to the kids. Let's take him out. Is it Merle? Merle! I don't believe it. No. Say it ain't true. Oh, oh maybe he's just here to pick up his kid or something. Yeah, well, I, th I think... Uh, Sorry, Merle, but your kid walked home. All right. Yeah, right here to the playground. Yeah, I guess this is like a little kid's school, because look at the playground area. Uh, can we close this door? Nope, that door does not close. Yeah, look at this. Oh, this is cool. It's one of those twirly-whirly things. Yeah, these are super dangerous. Yeah, they don't make them like this anymore. The old metal, rusty, rusty metal uh, playground toys. <laughs> they don't make them like they used to. Polina, come on. We don't have time for this. Get off the, the slide. We gotta go finish this school. There's good loots in here. We might find that crucible recipe. Paulina, come on! Oh, man. She loves playgrounds. All right, here she comes. All right, good, 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 good. Okay, you ready? All right, that was fun. Yeah, you know what? You gotta have some enjoyment once in a while. You just gotta just let loose and have a little fun. Otherwise, you go insane in these apocalypses, right? Okay, let's go... Where were we? We were over here in this room. Uh, some kind of a... Uh, maybe a faculty lounge, it looks like. Let's see what's in here. Trophy. Teachers love their trophies. Um, nothing there. I'll, I'll go through the, win uh, the windows. Oh, save. I'll, I'll check the paintings and all those later. Um, I just want to focus right now on the, uh, the good loots, like this stuff right here. I want to focus on the saves and the bookshelves and that kind of thing. Look at that. One try. Not too shabby. AK-47 in the teacher's lounge. <laughs> and baseball parts. I thought this was a gun-free zone. Let's, uh, let's grab this gun and check it out. Yeah, that's a nice one, all right. It's in pretty rough shape. I'm not going to use it right now, but we're certainly going to keep that and compare it with our other AK-47. Back at home base. All right. Let's keep moving. All right. Well, good to know that the teachers here had a, a hidden weapon to defend themselves with during this zombie apocalypse, right? Absolutely a good idea. Now, let's check the kitchen. All right. That's about it for the first floor. I got all the cabinets. Yeah. Okay. Let me go dump this stuff out in our chest over here. And then we're going to head upstairs and uh, raid the second floor and see what kind of goodies we got up there. All right. That's it. Let's do it. We should probably eat something, though. What do we have? We have bacon and eggs. Let's do it. Mm, mm, mm. Not very fresh, but very filling. And that'll restore some of that stamina. Okay. Up we go. Now, I may have missed some things down here. If you noticed that, let me know down in the comments. But I think we got everything. Nice and slow now. There could be some ferals in here. Other nasty things that can run fast. So we just want to be prepared for that. I've been taking it slow and easy. But, oh, big mama. She must be a teacher's assistant. Or maybe she's a substitute. Um, who's this guy? I'm not just, yeah, we're just going to do this fast and get our experience. There we go. Come on out. You oh, there's a feral. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, 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 oh. Big Mama takes a few rounds. That was a feral. You saw those red eyes. All right. You know what have we got here? Oh, empty bookshelf. What we do with backpack? Water. Water bottle. Somebody left a water bottle. I'm sure they'll be crying all the way home for it. Where's my water? <laughs> Mom, I need water. Ooh. Ooh, zigging and zagging. Gotcha. Oh, get, get, get she down. Get you down, you zigzagging feral. We don't like your kind here. Zigzagging ferals. <laughs> what do we got here, by the way? Gothic pants. Ooh, those are cute. 
What is Paulina wearing right now? Oh, her shorty shorts. Ooh. I'm not so sure those are approved for this school. <laughs> They're pretty short. Isn't there a dress code? I don't know. This school seems a bit loosey-goosey on their rules. Guns, short shorts, zombies. Yeah, it's the worst. All right, in we go, and an empty bookshelf. That's too bad. But we got two downstairs. Ugh, ugly brown tank top. Pauline will take it. We'll collect some dyes anyway. All right, let us continue down the hall here and see what's up. Another locked door. Not gonna slow Paulina down. Looks like another bathroom. Let's check the tea rash. Ooh, more garbage on the ground here. Uh, lead. Oh, we leveled up! Another skill point to spend. That's the one we were waiting for. I really don't like spending these on these kind of skills. I like combat skills and skills that make us faster and stronger, but this is gonna give us better loot, and we really need that crucible. So let's do it. Adds 40 to loot bonus, looting is 60% faster, and narrow down buried treasure locations to 4 meters. Yay! Okay. That should help, I think, with the uh, with the recipes, right? I'm assuming. Hello? Anybody here? We're coming in. Anybody? Nope. Just the backpack. Okay. Goody, goody. Oh, that's not. Anything. We'll grab the lemonade. Sometimes you find weapons and stuff in the um, in the toilets too, actually, so it's worth looking. There's a wrench and some nitrates. Is that it? What is this all about? Crank up your light. Yeah, nothing. This is very, very dark is all that is. Okay, let's move on. We're running out of rooms, but we do have the bookshelves, two bookshelves downstairs. Hello? Oh, another bookcase. Uh, let's check it. Let's check it. And I want you guys to cross your fingers, cross your toes, cross your mud flaps, and anything else that you can cross to give us good luck. Because we're going to do it. Ready? Three, two, one. Come on, baby. Give us a crucible. Double barrel shotgun schematic. Hmm. That is not a crucible. That is not a crucible. What kind of school is this? Let's bust on in. I think everybody's left for the day. I don't hear anybody in this school anymore. Uh, well, I guess I'll take the brass. We, we have space. I usually do not. Oh, 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 oh. Another bookcase. Come on. Military armor schematic. Already have it. So I will sell that one. And what do we got here? Empty can. And an old office chair. All right. Let's head downstairs. We've got two bookshelves left although wait a second is there a roof i mean there's a roof just don't know how to get up to the roof maybe there's a hatch or a ladder or something i mean it's clearly a roof <laughs> i mean don't all buildings have well not all buildings especially not during the zombie apocalypse but i would imagine oh here we go we can just go right out the window yeah get out here to this rooftop. I'm just curious. Before we go down to the last few bookshelves, let's bust on out. Might be some goodies out here. Could also potentially be some nasty buzzards. Nothing. Looks looks relatively safe so far. Nothing there. Just air conditioning units. That's about it. Oh, we can go up even higher. But how do we get up there? We're going to have to climb. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Hoop. Hoop, hoop. And we're up. This is a nice view of this town. Check it out. Love this town. But I'm getting kind of tired of this town. <laughs> I like driving around in the motorcycle and exploring, and we will do that once we find this crucible. I think Jen the trader gets new um, new goods tomorrow, the 25th. Right? I'm pretty sure that's what she said last time we were there. So maybe if we don't get the crucible today. We might still get one tomorrow at her shop. Well, the roof is clear, which is odd. Because you never usually see a clear roof unless there's something up there. But that was just glass, right? We looked, we saw that glass roof from down below. Nothing special there. All right, let's go. All right, let's hop back in the school and go check the last bookshelves. Two to go. Two to go. 
number one. Right here. Come on, baby, give us something good. Steel tools. All right, well, that's good. It's something new, but it's not a crucible. We can make steel tools. All right, and this is it. The last one here at the school. Don't fail us now. Oh, you drag dang it. Rackus, fracus. Already have this. Good idea, Paulina, coming to the school. Looking for bookshelves. And we got all of them, but no crucible. So we have struck out yet again. Can we check the buses? Oh, short bus. <laughs> we got the short bus. Yes, you can check the buses. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that. Let's check them all. Maybe somebody left some bullet casings in one of them. Interesting. <laughs> And how about in the back? I think I saw a bus out back. Let's go check that uh, last bus. It's the big bus. Oh, iron. It's not bad. And brass. I'm going to start taking this stuff. And we'll probably make some bullets sooner or later. And two coins. Okay, well, looks like we struck out. So, Pony is going to grab her loot and head home. Okay, just transferring stuff to the motorcycle. And I think we can get everything. There we go. Fantastic. All right, school's out. I hear the crickets. Time to go home. Boing. All right, let's let's uh, let's head back to base. I'm going to get organized. And in the next episode, we're going to go... We're going to go shopping. I'm going to go back to Jen's, and hopefully she'll have that dang crucible. Because I just don't know what else to do. We've been after this thing forever. And we can't really progress um, we can't do anything with steel obviously until we get the crucible because we can't make steel and that's really what's holding us back I mean we can still explore and do fun stuff but I really want to upgrade all the gear so hopefully Jen will have one we shall see all right so for now my friends we're gonna call it quits I hope you enjoyed this episode Going back to school with Paulina. That was quite fun, wasn't it, Paulina? Yeah, what was your favorite part? Uh, killing zombies? No. Uh, looking for books? No. Playground? Yeah, I thought so. I knew it. She loves a playground. Okay, well, we'll go back there another day. But right now, you're going to get organized. So there she goes. Okay, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.